You can make this as big as you want. So as you're lying down on your back and you pull your knees in, allow your forehead and your knees to come in contact with each other at the same time. Now, you can use the breath breathing into the back body. And then if it feels good to you, soften your head down, pull those knees in a little bit closer. And we're gonna come into air chair. So just take your knees out parallel, press your hands into your knees. And find that resistance. If we create it, create it on the outside, maybe we can let go of it on the inside. Now let's squeeze the knees together. You're gonna bring your arms down to your side, knuckles up. Take both knees over towards the right. Just let them hover. On the next breath, come back to center. Take both knees to the opposite direction, hover. Center, to the right. Center, left. Center, take the left leg out. Take both legs over towards the right. Center, switch, right leg up, left leg down, to the left. Center, switch, left leg up, to the right. Center, right leg up, left leg down, over to the left. Center, both legs up. To the right. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Inhale, up. Mm. To the other side. It's a good way to start Sunday morning. To the center. All the way to the right. Center. Left. Center. One more set to the right. Go big, go big. Extend that left leg. Come back to center. To the left, extend the right leg. Mm, center. From here, cross your ankles, right ankle over the left. You can bring your hands to your sides. Lift and lower your hips. Now lift and hold. Uh, lower the hips. Take your shoelace. You're just going to bring those ankles in towards you. Widen your sit bones. One more big breath here. legs. Take those right toes behind the left calf. Eagle arm, right arm underneath the left. 
Now find the stretch, let your feet rest towards the floor as your hands come up over your head. On the exhale, pulse it, elbows and knees. Just little pulses. And then hold. Tuck your chin in. Belly button in and up. Squeeze your inner thighs. Oh, unwind it. Happy baby, grab the outside blades of your feet. Relax the shoulders away from your ears. Press the back of your head into the mat. Legs straight up. Arms to your sides, cross the left ankle over the right. Hip ups. Imagine you're trying to draw your feet towards the ceiling. Hold. Lower it down. Cross those knees, grab your ankles, shoelace. Relax your jaw. Relax your face. Relax your buttocks. Eagle legs. Eagle arms. Find that good stretch. On the exhale, elbows and knees and pulse. We'll bring the elbows and the knees together, hold. Squeeze your inner thighs. A little bit more, a little bit more. Ah, uh, let's release. Happy baby, grab the outside blades of your feet. Take a big breath in. You can side out. And one more time, pull your knees in. You're gonna roll three times. Go right to crow. Five breaths. Remember, you can also stay in copper squats. It's an option. Place your right foot down on the ground. Inhale the left leg up, standing splits. On your inhale, lengthen. On your exhale, fold. Wrap your hands around the right ankle. On your next breath, release your hands. Look forward. 
Hop the right leg back. One-legged high plank. One-legged low. One-legged up dog. One-legged down dog. Bring your left foot through to the top of the mat, warrior one. Warrior two. Peaceful warrior. Side angle stretch. Bring the right arm up and over. Bring your right hand down to the mat. Now toe heel your left foot all the way over towards the left side of the mat. You're gonna stay on the blade of your back foot. Walk your hands out in front of you. A little bit more. A little bit more, so it's kind of like down dog arm. Now drop the elbows. Keep working on lengthening and broadening through the collarbone. You're doing great. One more breath. Lift those elbows up. Take that left arm up towards the sky. Thread the left arm underneath the right. Reach for that back thigh bone. Straighten your front leg. Look underneath your right armpit. Sweep that left arm up towards the sky, backing it out. Two piece fingers are gonna grab the big toe of your left foot. Side plank splits. Roll on to the blade of that right foot. Take your left leg up. Look up, mama. There you go, there you go. Bring your left foot through to the top. Lower the right knee down to the ground. Anjane Asana, arms up. Now bring your hands to prayer at the center of the chest. Right elbow is gonna to go to the left knee. Now take your right hand, place it on your left butt cheek. If your straddle's too big, it might be a little bit more difficult to do this pose. So keep that in mind. Left arm up. Reach back with your left hand. Pull the right heel in. Grab it with the left hand. Close the knee joint. Cross the right foot over towards the left hip. Grab that big toe with your right hand. Take your left arm up towards the sky. Take your left arm towards the top of your mat. Find the extension. Warrior two on your knees. <laughs> I love the facial expressions. Peaceful warrior, right arm down, left arm up. Helicopter your hands to the top of the mat. Engage the ball of your right foot. 
standing splits, bring your left leg up. Inhale, lengthening. Exhale, fold. On your next breath, lengthen your spine. Hop the left foot to the back of the mat. Come forward into a one-legged high plank. Low. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Bring your right foot through to the top, warrior one. Warrior two. Peaceful warrior. Side angle stretch. Let that left arm come up and over. Place the left hand down on the mat. Toe heel your right foot over. Staying on the blade of your back foot. So work through your hips. Extend your hands out in front of you. Down dog arms. Drop your elbows. Lift your elbows, right arm up. Thread the right arm underneath the left. Reach for the back thigh. Look underneath your left armpit and then straighten the front leg. On your next breath, sweep the right arm up towards the sky, keeping that front leg nice and straight. Let the right hip fall towards the floor. Two piece fingers grab the big toe. Side plank splits as you elevate that right leg up. Bring your right foot through to the top. Anjane Asana, lower the left knee down. Hands to prayer. Add the twist, left elbow, right knee. Feel that connection between your armpit and your knee. The left hand's gonna reach for that right butt seat. Right arm reaches high. Right hand goes back. Pull that heel in. Close the joint. Move that left foot over towards the right. Two piece fingers will grab each other. Right arm up. Right arm up and over. Warrior two on our knees. Woo. He 
peaceful warrior. Left hand down. Helicopter your hands to the top of the mat. Engage your left leg. Bring the left leg forward to meet the right forward fold. Inhale, lengthening. Next, exhale, folding. Inhale, sweep your arms up nice and high. Standing bow, reach back with the right hand. Place the right foot on the inside. Kick away when you're ready. Bring your torso parallel to the floor. Bring the left hand down to the mat. Hold on nice and tight to that back foot. Just kick it towards the ceiling. Release the foot into half moon. At Poetic Warrior, hands to prayer. Bend your left knee and cover. Now your gaze goes towards the right side of the room versus the floor. And warrior two. Peaceful warrior, right arm down, left arm up. Side and stretch, left hand down, right arm nice and high. Coming into a wide legged straddle, grab the outside blades of your feet. Lengthen and fold it. Again, lengthen and fold it. Bring your arms out to your side in the shape of a T. Inhale, come up nice and slow with the flat back. Happy cow arms, right arm high. Place the right hand between your two scapulas. Take your left hand behind you. There you go, grab your props piece. Find the front body stretch first. Feel that opening through the collarbone. Right arm on top, left arm on the bottom. On your exhale, fold. Connect with your breath. Subtle movements to open up the body. One more breath. Inhale, come up nice and slow with the flat back. Release your arms up towards the sky. Right foot meets the left. We're gonna stay facing the garden. Hands will come to prayer at the center of the chest. The right elbow comes in contact with your left knee for a twist. Come up onto your tippy toes. Lower your tailbone down. 
Add a full bind, right arm down, left arm up. The left arm goes behind with those arms underneath you. We'll bring hands to prayer. Now you can stay here or fly it. Side pro, fallen angel, whatever you got in your toolbox. Five breaths. Nice Pam. We're going to meet on our bellies. Reach back with your hands, palms down. Rock yourself from side to side. Salabhasana, right leg up. Right leg down, left leg up. Left leg down. Bring those hands in a little closer. Both legs up. Ah, uh, let's release. Rock your hands from underneath you. Set yourself up, high plank. And downward facing dog. Walk your dog out. Shake your head up and down. And we'll come up onto our tippy toes. Look in the direction you want to go in, which is forward. Walk, jump, or fly to the top. We'll lengthen. And exhale, fold. Inhale, arms rise. Good side, number two. Take that left arm back. <laughs> Take the right hand to the mat. Just marinate here. Half moon, let that leg go. Poetic warrior. <laughs> warrior two.
Mm, peaceful warrior. Side angle stretch. Let that left arm rise above you. Wide-legged straddle, grab the outside blades of your feet. Again, find that space, lengthening on your inhale, and folding on your exhale. Hmm. Arms out to your sides. Flat back, inhale up. The left arm comes up. Place that left hand between your two scapulas. Happy cow. Find the back bend, open it up first. On your exhale, lean into it. On your next inhale, rise. Our arms will come up. Ooh. The left foot meets the right. Sit into your chair. Hands to prayer. Left elbow, right knee. Tippy toes to the heels. Add that big bind. Right arm, right arm behind.
You're almost there. Just a little bit more. Mm, that's relief. Let your hands out from underneath you. Child's pose, push back. Let's interlace our fingers behind our backs. Roll on to the top of the head. You take your hands towards the top of your mat. Back to child's pose. Just bring your hands to your side so your fingertips will line up onto your shoulders. And you can come into a sheer shasana headstand. And then from your headstand, if you're feeling strong today, then add like lotus legs, crow, uh, another variation, maybe press up into a handstand. Just five breaths. And when you feel complete, we'll just meet back in child's pose. We'll take it into camel pose, coming up onto our knees, reach back to the heels of your feet, stretch it out. Now, if you enjoy this kind of class, next Sunday, Batia is teaching a three hour workshop. Plenty of core, arms, back, handstands. And downward facing dog. Walk your dog out. Right leg up, mm, warrior one. Mm, warrior two. Peaceful warrior. Side angle stretch. Goddess. Take your hands to your thighs. Open up your hips. <sighs> Take the right shoulder towards the floor. <sighs> the left shoulder towards the floor. <sighs> One more time, the right shoulder. Left shoulder. 
And coming back to center, extend your arms out towards your neighbor and hover. One more breath, you're doing great. And hands down, straighten your legs, turn your heels out, lengthen. And again, fold. One more time, inhale, lengthen. Now pivot your fingertips and your toes towards the top of the mat. Slide the right leg up and back. Flip the dog. Add a wheel pose if you'd like. Transitioning into the full expression of a back bend. As we gently back out, bring the right foot through to the top. Lower the left knee down, Anjane Asana, arms up. Bring your hands to prayer. Add the twist. This time you're gonna do a reverse bind. Engage your back leg. Straighten your front. Turn your toes towards the right. So you're in a twisted root. Toe, heel your feet in towards each other. Look to the right. Oh, unwind it. Bring the right foot and the left foot together. Forward fold, inhale, lengthening. Exhale, folding. Inhale, sweep it up, reach it towards the sky, find the front body stretch. On your exhale, swan dive. Inhale, lengthen. Chaturanga Dandasana. We'll meet in up dog, just hold your up dog, no rush. Let's walk over the right shoulder. Let the left hip soften. We'll come back to center. Look towards the left. Come back to center. Downward BC dog. Last leg up. Bring it through to the top, warrior one. And warrior two. Peaceful warrior. Side angle stretch. Make that transition to goddess. Hmm. 
Down dog arms. Make the transition where your hands go behind you. Palms to the floor, pinkies in. On your next breath, to straighten your legs. Lengthen and fold. On the next breath, we'll extend our arms out in front of us. Pivot towards your left foot. Take that left leg all the way up. And flip it. Take it into your wheel. A wild thing of any variation of a back bend you would like. You'll make your transition where the left foot comes through to the top. Lower that right knee down on Janaeus. Arms. Hands to prayer. Add your reverse spine. Right elbow down. Engage the back leg. Straight in the front. Breathe. Turn your toes towards the left. We go over your left shoulder. Unwind your arms, inhale, lengthen. Turn everything towards the left foot. Then have your right foot meet it, forward fold. Inhale, lengthening. On your exhale, fold, chest to thighs. One more time, reach towards the sky, stretch out the front body. Feel all that blood pumping through your veins. Exhale, fold, bring your hands down. Grab your hands and elbows and allow yourself to sort of just relish in the forward fold. Shaking the head up and down. Interlace your fingers behind your head. Squeeze those elbows in around your ears. Give your neck and your head a gentle tug. Check in with your jaw and make sure that that is soft as well. Mm, nice and slow. Let's release right onto our back spinal savasana. Woohoo! You did it.
sweep towards the mirror. They're going to take you for breakfast this morning. <laughs> Arms out your sides. If you feel like you need grounding, then keep your palms down. If you're feeling pretty grounded, then it's a good time to turn your palms up. But only you know for sure what you need. We'll just use this time to integrate everything we just did.
All right, peeps. Take a nice big breath in. Put your arms over your head. And we'll roll over to the right side. And we'll come up into a comfortable seat. Eyes lower, eyes closed. We'll bring our hands to prayer at the center of the chest. I'm grateful for this new day, its beauty and its light and a chance to begin again. May we all be freed from yesterday's limitations and today may we be reborn. Mm, Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Peace. Peace. And from my heart to yours, namaste. Namaste. Have a great day, peeps. Have a great day. Thanks so much for coming. Thanks so much. I'm <laughs> <laughs>